church. He didn't wait to sift your whole nation. Right. But what he says, but I pray. And he said his prayer is uh -huh. that when your faith returns, uh -huh. ooh, help me. All right. yeah. he said, I know what you're gonna go through, and what, you, and what, and his plan is that the test is gonna weaken your faith. <laughs> he said, but I'm only giving him access to the stuff because he had he got access by request. I'm only giving him access to the stuff. That when it happens, it don't break you, but it builds you. Right. That's why I told him for Job. He said, "Go ahead. I know what he can take. Uh, you think if you mess up with his home situation and you mess everything up and I'm breaking, but it ain't gonna break it. Go." Uh -huh. And he came back. He said, "You're right. It didn't break it. It built you." Uh -huh. And so why, why, why you don't want the adversary at the table? The adversary needs to be at the table. But God has not only given, given him access, when he gives him access, he prophesies over you. Yeah. All right. And he doesn't say, should your faith return? Oh, no. Should you get it together? No, he said, I, I have already figured it out. I'm smarter than he is. I've given him ammunition, but the ammunition I gave him can't kill you. It can only fill you. Oh. It can knock you down, but it can't keep you down. It can put you out, but it can't lock you out. I give him access to some of your secret files. But I only gave him access to your secret files so that when he gets out, you'll understand that it don't matter what they say. <laughs> if I thought it would break you, I would have kept it in the secret place. But I gave him access to it. He knows about your past. He knows about your history. He knows where you've been. But the point is that when he finishes with it, what you're going to say is, I don't care what you know about it. I'm here to tell you that he don't know that's who I used to be. That's not who I am now. Because God has to live So that preacher said in my ear, that preacher said, so our problem is that we running around acting like stuff, matter that don't matter. Why we need to understand that why we run around matter that they like us and, 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 and who they talking about and why they call that person two times and beat one time and why they don't return my text and why they get to sit over there and I have to sit over there. God said, you need to be careful, baby, because we're talking about nonsense, Satan is making a demand. And I figured out that there was a chain of command that had to go to 
it was to get something that unorthodox to prove to them, and it had to go up the flagpole. Well. That's what happens when you ask me to pray for you. Come on, come on. That's what happened when you put your little $5 into the television robbers and put your and put your prayer request on it and then something. I'm not asking anybody else to pray for you, baby. 